Hello world, hello mundo, good night. I know it's a little later, but I felt I felt like reading and I think somebody out there needs to hear this and I probably need to hear it myself. I'm just gonna flip the page and see where it lands. Let's see what this good pasture gas for us, pasture TV Jakes, baby. Let's see. Stop speaking to you because you won't 
pay her rent anymore but it may be time for you to stop making her rent more of a priority than securing your own financial future maybe someone you consider your friend will kick you to the curve because you stop hanging out so much with the fellas to be with your girlfriend prioritize your relationships and you will discover who your real friends are you will always find excuses to wait to wait your decision to prioritize destiny will always make someone angry but better that person be angry with you than for you to be angry with you and guarantee i guarantee you will end up an angry person the day you awaken spiritually spiritually and realize that you've adhered to everyone's priorities except your own Accept your own. Your chief priority is an, an appointment with destiny. <clears throat> That's true, World Mundo. Put your priorities first. And that goes for me too. Destiny is spelled prioritize. Get your relationships, money, and thoughts in step with your destiny. When you understand the steps needed to take you to the next level. if you are living according to the priorities you have said other people may not understand your choices or your lifestyle and may even ridicule you for them but when you know why you are making certain choices their criticism their criticism their, their criticism doesn't matter the haters don't matter your happiness will come from setting the priorities you need for the vision you have locked into that doesn't mean you won't have frustrating moments that doesn't mean you won't want to give up sometimes it means that when your life is prioritized in a way that makes sense for you to reach destiny you experience destiny satisfaction and true contentment while other people are seeking satisfaction through things social or people or social standing you have an opportunity for true joy and contentment by having your priorities in order your priorities are right when you make choices that lead you toward destiny so what if your cell phone still flips open and doesn't have a touch screen so what if date night consists of you of consists of a frozen pizza and two dollar dvd from a bending machine So what if the bottoms of your shoes are not red and you don't have a handbag with someone's name on it? So what if you don't wear a suit and a and tie to work? So what if you pass up a date to stay home to help your child with this algebra? So what if you pull away from visionless people who have no plans for their future and don't want you to have any either when you make decisions about what is best for you? Based on your priorities, you are much less likely to be concerned about critical com commentary from people who have nothing to do with your destiny. Prioritize your relationships. I spoke in Ghana to a group of CEOs, politicians, and faith leaders about the importance of relationships. Anyone who understands business knows the ability to build and maintain relationships with the clients, customers, staff, and other companies is prerequisite. Pre prerequisite. Pre 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 no, I'm gonna do my best. It's a prerequisite for successful business. If you can't build relationships, you are being torn down. Build relationships takes time. That people often are to the boat, partly because time is limited resources for us all. Most of us have at one time or another spent a lot of energy, time and effort investing in relationships that show little return. I don't I don't necessarily mean financial return. I mean investment growth or alignment with your vision. I'd rather you waste my money than waste my time. I earnestly believe that you must quantify the time you spend in relationships that may not be destructive but yet may be con 
invest money into your destiny if you waste time. The true parameter to help you evaluate the relationship to invest in must certain of this significant question. How does this person fit into my destiny and purpose? If you would approach your time with the same sense of fiduciary duty as your money, you would see a far greater return. People who are truly engaged want to know where do I fit in your life and destiny? And to that question can be answered. Good people will leave you because they can live in the clutter of your indecisiveness to maximize the years you have left. Clear the clutter. Priorities can require us to find a new to find new friends and associates, be, be selective and determine your associations. Carefully prioritize the persons with whom you will spend time and know why they are in your life. Your old buddy from junior high may not be the best person for you to associate with. You may be from the hood and try to prove that you haven't forgotten where you came from. Old acquaintances may even accuse you of forgetting where you came from staying in touch with the old gang from the hood is not a requirement for destiny and you don't have to prove yourself to anyone sometimes you simply have to break away from an unhealthy people and relationships when ex-offenders are placed on parole and probation very often there are st st they are stipulations regarding persons they may spend time with to reduce the likelihood of a repeat offense. The first thing to do in deciding what stays in your life and what goes is to determine what nourishes you and strengthens, strengthens you. While it is nice to be philanthropic, many are trying to help with while they are not capable of standing strong themselves. If you've been off track and lost time, miss moments and
journey to destiny includes every part of your life, especially your finances. Financial advisors, advisors will tell you they can look at your bank statement, know where your priorities lie. What does your bank account say about you? Do you look like a million dollar with only a few dollars in the bank and nothing safe for retirement? Are you barely making minimum minimum payments on your credit cards? Are all of your credit cards at their maximum balance? Financial advisors have a saying that if you are side, that if you are sitting on your assets, your priorities are all wrong. In other words, if all of your discretionary income is spent on an expensive clothes.
believe it or not, some have never been allowed to prioritize their own lives. There is a son who longed to school, but because his parents are both PhDs, they use parental pressure to steer him to a big to a vocation that is more palatable to them. There is a daughter who loves cars and dreams of being a master mechanic, but Love you, bro. Love you, Mundo. Subscribe. Hit the 